Let me derive the mean and the variance for the uniform distribution for you. Mean and variance for the uniform. Remember that the uniform distribution is kind of the, the constant distribution on some um, interval between A and B with a constant density of uh, 1 over B minus A. So if we are going to find the expected value, the mean of this distribution, and using the formal definition of the mean of a continuous random variable like this, over S, the entire uh, space of possible outcomes, it becomes explicitly the integral from A to B. Actually, if we should be formal about it, uh, this is for X smaller than, larger than A and smaller than B, and then the F of X would be zero otherwise. That is the definition of the density. So it's x times 1 over b minus a dx. This is an easy function to find the integral of. We can take the b minus a outside, find the, the function with x as a derivative. That would be 1 half x squared between a and b. So we just plug in 1 over b minus a, 1 half times b to the square minus a to the square. Now uh, b to the square minus a squared would equal, I just repeat, b minus a over 1 half. Um, that would be the sum of b plus a times the difference between b and a. So we can see that we are left with, this one cancels out with this one, and we are left with sort of the obvious, namely that the mean of a uniform distribution is right in the middle of the interval between A and B, the, the sort of the average of A and B. Now for the variance part, I first will find the mean of the square of X, and then use that to deduce the variance. For the mean of the square, again, the integral from a to b of x squared, 1 over b minus a dx. Again, an easy function to integrate. The function whose derivative would be x squared would be 1 third x to the third from a to b. And then I plug in, I say I have one third, I have one over b minus a, and then I have b to the power of three minus a to the power of three. Then I find the variance as, using the usual formula where we find the variance as the mean of the square of x minus the square of the mean of x which means that I take one-third, one over b minus a, b to the third minus a to the third, and then I take the mean of x, which I just found a second ago, which was a plus b half, and the square of that. And then, finally, we would need some simplification of this which I'm not going to stand here and go through. It's a little bit boring. But actually, if we do some steps here, finally we achieve the simplified expression of 1 12th of b minus a squared, which is the variance of the uniform. Thank you. <laughs>